All right, core two of Sprita and is back. Last episode, a little bit of a snooze fest, but we gotta let it cook, right? We gotta let it build. We're gonna go into this new, like, battle royale, you know, academy. What's it called? Some kind of, it's like a driver's license exam, pretty much, right? It's gonna be super hype. Hopefully, it begins today. Let's begin today's reaction. First class mage exam. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Yes, yes. No, don't you dare make this episode be about getting there. Don't. Just fly, motherfuckers. Please, save me an episode. <laughs> they never fly, man. <laughs> She's probably so overqualified for these, you know, this exam. Isn't she already? She's like C rank or something, right? Only a handful of the most skilled mages has ever gained first class. Look at the look at the models, right? It's kind of hard to tell, but one, two, three, four, five, six, and then there's a girl. I think we've seen this girl, the long haired girl with like I think she's also an elf, right? In the opening. Okay, so there's about seven of these first class mages. Okay. Oh. Interesting. Are we gonna fight those mages? Alright, the monsters? Damn, it's just in the middle of like a, like a river, like a, what is this, a lake? Yeah, what's Stark gonna do this entire time too, huh? Is Stark just, like what, he's not a magician! Is he gonna be cheerleading? Ooh, combat test. Combat test. You too, Fern. Like, even when suppressing the magic, what tier is she, right? Imagine she's, like, able to be first class or higher while suppressing the magic, and then she lifts the limiter. Can we even, like, gauge her power? You're a granny, come on now. Baba. You still remember that? Yeah, she holds grudges. This, this pout is cute, though. I, that, we got a lot of Farron pouts, right? This this Freedom pout. Maybe this could be the uh, this could be the thumbnail today. I've seen a lot of Farron pouts, but Freedom pout's nice, too. Oh. Oh. Yo. I, I don't... I, maybe it's just me and my degenerate Twitter algorithm, right? Because the For You page is pretty much just, like, showing the stuff that I want to see. But, like, this girl, Farron, is just always closed from, like, head to toe. There's, like, no cleavage, no nothing. But I swear to God, there's so much, like, NSFW fan art. Every fucking artist is, like, looting her. And even right now, this isn't helping, right? Like, when you do shit like this, and I'm not really complaining, but I'm starting to understand why they loot Farron so much. <laughs> Big ass mountain in front of me, bro. Oh, no, never mind. Because the other half was fucking covered by the... You know. You know. She's a little jealous, yeah. Yeah, what, what, what else does? Bus size? Sex appeal? What? Sure, sure. Yeah, what are you going with this? Talent. I've lost 11 times. Okay, this is important. To majors who've had less mana. Interesting. Well, the bigger mana pool doesn't really mean that you're going to win, but interesting. 11 times you lost to people with less mana. Okay, and the other seven? Another elf? Is it the girl from the chair in the opening? The girl, you know, the in the middle when they said the seven, you know, first class? It's gotta be, right? Maybe? Away? It was... Oh, who's this? New characters? Okay, new characters, let's go! Her look of her eyes is kind of... I don't know, it's cool. She looks like she's pretty chill and kind of like looking down. Oh, she doesn't give a fuck. She is pretty cocky, huh? Yeah, she's got those dead eyes. Oh, what the fuck? Hey! That's the dude! That's one of the heroes! Wait, wait! Craft! Craft is his name, right? What the fuck is Craft doing here? He's a legendary hero, dude! 
Mr. Legendary Elf Hero Craft is back? Let's go? Will he be also par taking part in the exam, maybe? Ubel. Ubel. <laughs> Dio. See? Something about her voice actor and her dead eyes. It's so cheeky, right? Look at her design. I'm sure a lot of people are going to love her just because of her eyes like this. <laughs> as soon as I say <laughs> nice things about her eyes, Kraft is like, <laughs> you have the eyes of a killer, I see. <laughs> oh? Yeah? Okay. Then what? Uber did this. She's been going around just killing people. Oh, so he saved the bandits from Uber. It's Uber. Oh. <laughs> Was it self-defense though? Are they gonna pair up now? Hmm. Okay, one of the candidates for the exam seems pretty strong, right? Bandit Slayer? Oh! What the fuck? I mean, this craft dude just shows up and leaves again? What the fuck? I, I, I guess it's too much when you expect that he would participate in the exam too, but this character literally just gets shown in, leaves. Like, we saw him once, leaves. And then he got introduced kind of like a proxy as a statue that he was here before as a legendary hero, leaves. Just shows up here, fucking takes on the bandit, leaves. What the fuck, dude? Come back! Alright. Two months? Okay, every three years is an exam. Minimum, we need a fifth class? Okay. Where, where, where are you going? <laughs> Get back in there. You won't. No, join in! <gasps> Not the snacks! Is she gonna give in because of the snacks? Hmm? Will it? Is it kind of old? Yeah, it's super old, right? But what does it mean? That old man seems to recognize it. Oh? What is it? Super rare? Based on the way that he cleared his throat and the way that he was, you know, looking at it, this is the, you know, you ever watch Punch? Uh, it's like the art of the deal, the negotiation, where the person realizes the value of it, but they don't want to, like, disclose how rare it is. So it's like, oh, oh it's not that important, you know? <laughs> Okay, so what was it then? It's gotta be impressive. Probably like a proof of a hero or something. <laughs> so many different ones pop up that she just pretty much gave up tracking, you know, which ones are which. Is it though? What about you, Aisa? No? Where did you even get it? I mean, all she does, all she has to do is just shoot a fucking beam as proof that she's a mage, doesn't she? Jesus! 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 But you'll die soon. <laughs> okay. She gets a headband instead. <laughs> Stark's so bored. When did she take it though? When did she take this exam? As a third class? Probably a long time ago? This is pretty cool though, the world building based on like the tier list of different strength of magicians. But to Freerun, it should be a walk in the park. Look at Stark still sleeping. Wait, we're gonna do a two month training arc and then the exam starts? Man! All right, well, at least we're building towards it.
Happy birthday! Is that- Wait! <laughs> Is that Freeman's birthday? Wait, 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 wait. How many candles? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 candles that we can see here. One big 21, maybe each candle is like 100 years. So what is she, 2,100 years? Who knows, but goddamn. Yeah, we're finally getting another free run cake. We have free run Borgar. We have free run Donut. We got free run Cake. Okay, eh, this is pretty good. Happy birthday. How, how the fuck does this even work? You just, you're like the bed's not even close, but you somehow gotta, okay, whatever. And now they're flying. You guys should be flying your, during your fucking, you know, travels. I know it costs a lot of mana to do it. Okay, two months training arc done. Let's go. Two months done, let's go. Ooh, who are these new characters, man? Weird Bell. The second class mage and captain of the Northern Magic Corp. He seems pretty strong, yeah? Oh, bro's been fighting the Demon King's remnants? Okay, okay. Dwarf? Another second class, though. An Imperial mage. I don't know what that really implies, but I guess Imperial mages are also very strong. Wait, Farron's on the fucking scout? Wait, they did intel on her? Farron, the youngest mage to ever... Receive a third class certification with top marks. Damn. They are fucking hyping this girl up. Because again, what I've noticed from this show is that when we're in the perspective of our party, Frieden, Baron, you know, Stark, everybody's kind of relative to each other. So I don't really know like how strong Farron is until she started fighting. And even when she started fighting, it's like, damn, like how strong really is she? She's fucking busted, especially against the fight with Lugner, right? And even now, people are like, damn, this girl? Because the way that she was talking about how she only was able to third class and free run was like, okay. But now other people are like, shit, this is the youngest mage ever to receive a third class certification with top marks. Yo, they're really hyping this up. <laughs> she's going for first class this time. <laughs> Ah, Ubel. Why she fail? For killing? Okay. Dude, she killed the first class mage who proctored it. It doesn't matter if she's only third or second tier. She killed a... Like, a proctor means like a referee, right? So the person who's pretty much just like managing the exam, like a test, like, referee, she killed the first class? Yo. They're kind of hyping up Ubel a lot, too. Look at those dead eyes. Frieden! Frieden! I see someone raiding the mana of an experienced boomer granny mage. And like, again, this is like nerf. This is like we're suppressing it. Oh my god. He's probably gonna think that she's nothing, right? He's gonna be like, oh, okay, this is elf girl, alright. How strong is she? Tell me. What's her power level? What's her power level? Come on. Okay. I'm gonna glance over her. Yeah. Parties of three, right? Who's in their party? Pretty sure based on the trailer, Farron and Frieden was, you know, separated. Wait, is this like optimized so that it's kind of more well balanced out so it's not complete RNG based on her, you know, talk? Okay. Yeah, remove your limiter. Come on. Okay. So basically, she's trying to be a mob character this start, I guess, based on what she's saying. Who is it? <laughs> These two are new party mates. I mean, hey, they look cute. All right, let's see it. What's going on? <laughs> she's got to do a little babysitting. Ferns with Uber? Ubel. Ubel. Hmm. Interesting development here. I see two bald people here. Bald, bald. Okay. Capture the bird? Okay, so get a bird. <laughs> Our party is just fucking around still. <laughs> Wait, wait, sorry, I missed something there. You capture the bird. So this is interesting because you could try to force someone else to kind of push them out of the barrier, right? I'm not sure if that's allowed, but if you're out of bounds, then you're done. 
Okay. So you can't get out. What? Uh, hey, they're listening at least. You know, even though they're fighting and kind of fucking around, I feel like they're still legit, right? They have to be if they're gonna be these kind of shitheads, right? They're probably super competent, but we're getting kind of baited to think that they might be useless. <laughs> yes. Yeah, they are. Frieden, get in there, Granny! Come on, babysit them! <laughs> Surprised they listened to Freeran. Lavine. Third class? Kanne. Lavine. Kanne. Childish friends? Okay. Yeah, it's a bird. They must have some special characteristics. See? Bird right there. How do we, like, bait a bird, though? Also, what is Stark doing right now? He's not a magician. Is Stark just like sleeping at home? You know, the best part about these two girls fighting is that Freedom will always be making that same like cat-like face, right? On the side. I think that's the best part of these girls fighting. Yeah. He's free from them. <laughs> Start kind of a vacation, actually, yeah. Are you strong? <laughs> How strong are they? I wanna... Compared to her. Oh. Smart girl. And keep in mind, that's with the mana being suppressed. Lavina just was immediately like, Nah, not you. I'm more worried about Farron's party because of you, Bell. I mean, she does kind of train. Like, she does kind of is a teacher to Farron. Look for the bird, right? What do you mean? Wait, wait, what's going on? What? Are there enemies in the sky? Whoa, 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 whoa. That was fast? So what do we do now? Bird capture magic! Ah oh, shit, Khan is going in. Oh? You you are you, you already fucked up. Wait. What are you doing? Teamwork? Oh. Was that both of them? Was Kanne water? And was Lavine ice there? Or was that all Kanne? Let's see the explanation. Interesting? Enemies in the sky, right? What? Why can the bird do that? Yo, this is fucking one punch bird. What the fuck? These little birds are this strong? Okay. Okay. <laughs> speed. Okay. Their speed is fast and they're very durable. Faster than the speed of sound. Oh, this is going to be fucking hard to catch here. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, we learned, I guess. Bait it with food. Okay, so Lavina did freeze it. It was teamwork. Gotcha, gotcha. They're like childhood friends. Their teamwork is like perfect, right? Yeah, their synchro is perfect. Even though they constantly fight with each other. <laughs> Maybe I'll talk too soon. In, in terms of planning and decision making, it fucking sucks. But in, in action, as long as we can plan and tell them what to do, it'll work. But other than that, they're just fighting all the time. <laughs> careful, careful. And it's gone. Holy shit, it's so fast, dude. <laughs> See, they keep doing this, right? There's a lot of scenes where it's like, usually it was with the mimics, right? But they always have like freedom being stuck in something with their gas sticking out. Sometimes they'll like swing her feet around too, but guys, they keep doing this, man. A lot of uh, Nia Freedom today, though. A lot of cat Freedom. Where's Frida at? Is she training? What's she doing? Late night training? Yeah, I do hear rain. 
No rain sounds, but... What? Sorry, no rain... Oh! Yo, these birds in the show are fucking strong. Holy shit! It's just a cute looking bird too. It's like a demon bird. Look at its horns. Isn't this the demon soundtrack too? Is it an actual demonic bird? What? Frieden? So that's what we have to be worrying about. Can you not sense the mana? Look out for the skies. I see. And a little cool detail here. When she was getting attacked here, you know, the first person that she mentioned was Lavine. Meaning, I don't know. She was worried about her friend that she's always fighting with, right? Alright, birds in this shore are very scary. Yeah, she instinctively said Lavine. Because she worried about her first? Nah, they like each other, right? They just... Never mind. I... Oh no, I feel like there's a strong bond. Even though they always look like they're fighting. So she hesitates, but Lavina maybe doesn't. Alright, let's see this Kane Lavine backstory. <laughs> I know you hate me. <laughs> she's kind of cold. And she's the type to always say, just like, never, it's never enough. <laughs> um, booty shorts, thighs. Twin tail. I'm sorry, guys. I can't name anymore. <laughs> huh? Wait, 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 what? What did she say there? You try really hard even though you're a coward. Is that a compliment? I guess it is. In a mean way. <laughs> Thanks. I guess. Alright. Yeah, pra praise me more or should I say insult me more? Oh, this is a nice one. Oh, Hey, all of a sudden, it's so cute between them. She just wants to get praised by this syndicate girl that hates giving praises. What the fuck? We're going Yuri now. Never mind. <laughs> Gross. Get the fuck out of my face. Is she dead? Well, obviously she's not. Hey! She's flying! <laughs> Isn't that how, like, mama birds teach their kids to fly? They literally just, like, fucking shove them out or something? I don't know. Okay. Oh? That's a chance? The raining sound, you mean? I don't get, I don't, I don't get this uh, raining sound thing. Wait, 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 what the fuck? Wait, what the fuck? That was the most abrupt ending to the fucking episode. What? I thought the, you know, anyways, let's just talk about the episode. The raining sound, I thought, was something about the barrier and how, like, we're in encapsulated here even though the raining noise are happening so it's like raining outside but the barrier is not letting in i don't know but somehow what she noticed perhaps with the rain sounds even though no rain has to do with being able to capture this this bird who is like a one punch bird yo this bird is fast as fuck i did not realize this little bird would be so hard to catch until it split the fucking red sea here like holy shit bro look at this shit it's like fucking moses dude one punch bird one of the coolest things about arcs like this, and it's my favorite kind of trope, is the introduction of all these different characters with all these different backgrounds, right? Suddenly the world building becomes a lot more clear. Everybody knows this character because they're, you know, famous for doing XYZ and they're known as this person and, and vice versa, right? 
I love moments like this. It hypes up. It gets their anticipation up for all these new characters, right? Hopefully, they're not mob characters. Hopefully, they're actually able to, you know, fight toe-to-toe -to -toe with, you know, Frieden. Probably not, but at least keep it close, right? Keep it entertaining. It's interesting that this guy did see that Frieden's, you know, mana, but obviously, we're hiding us. So, who really knows, you know, how strong Frieden is compared to everyone else here? I'm just going to go off the bat and just say that Farron, I think she is already first class. And I think this anime is basically smurfing. I think we are underestimating ourselves. Baron probably is first class and Freeran obviously beyond that a long time ago, right? And she removes her limiter. How would everyone else in this room react? Who really knows? And there's another mention of 11 people with less mana than Freeran that she's lost to, right? One of them was an elf. I believe the elf is shown in the opening sequence, right? I forget exactly where, but there is like this like elf that's like sitting on a chair in yeah, 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 yeah. this girl right here, right? So I wonder if she's talking about that. Who knows? But finally, we're getting the meat of this exam. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.